How long have you been living in this neighborhood? Oh man, since 1978. You've seen a lot. Seen a lot, yeah. And recently, not much of it has been good, according to Wes, a longtime resident of Manita Street in the South Bronx. A walk up his block is littered with used drug needles and feces. At the corner, one of the South Bronx's many homeless shelters. They'll be sleeping on the street. Uh, I said what? Defecate. <laughs> Oh, you mean going to the bathroom in between the in park between cars? cars? Yeah, exactly. This has been occurring since before this migrant crisis occurred. Um, and historically, the city of New York has looked at the South Bronx as a dumping ground. Councilman Rafael Salamanca represents this district. We interviewed him Wednesday across the street from the drop-off shelter known in the neighborhood as the living room. I have over 60 homeless shelters in my council district alone. Six zero? Six zero. How does that compare to other districts in the Bronx? You have other community uh, uh, council districts that have less than five shelters in their districts. Stop looking at the South Bronx. Mayor Eric Adams has repeatedly acknowledged the oversaturation of shelters in Salamanca's district. But the shelters are already here. The result, Salamanca says, of the constant and desperate need to continue expanding a shelter system that was already bursting at the seams before the migrant crisis. He adds business-savvy developers are drawn to the South Bronx because of cheap land and low property values. That means that a sector car with two police officers has to respond here, and you're pulling that car from actually patrolling on New York City streets. Residents here, families, are now living with the consequences of this shelter oversaturation. Councilman Salamanca's office sharing with us local 41st precinct crime stats connected with the living room, the shelter located at 800 Barreto Street, showing 80% of the precinct's 911 calls over the last six months were all tied to this shelter. In the other locations around here, like in Manhattan or something, mm -hmm. there's too much around here.